I just, just stick to your friends. Be fine. Hey, hey, come on in. Come have breakfast with us. I made pancakes, and I made the sausage that you like, an omelet. Come, 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 come yeah. sit. Yeah. These eggs are spectacular. With the onions and the peppers? I love it. I love it. Did, uh, did he spend the night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He slept here in this house. <laughs> I'm an adult. I can do that. <laughs> I, I need to talk to you about something. Okay. I was thinking that it's time to think about getting your own apartment. What? Why would you say that? Well, you are so awesome. And I think I've been there for you too much. Because sometimes in life, the thing that's motivating is when people don't have that safety net. Right, right. But I need that safety net because I don't have my shit together. So, like, what, why are you doing this? Is this because of him? No. It's just you're 24 years old now. 24? I mean, Phelps had a fistful of gold medals by 24. Why are you talking? I'm just giving you some perspective, that's all. You know, Wayne Gretzky had like 96 goals when he was 24. Wh what? Roger Staubach graduated at West Point, won a Heisman Trophy, fought in the Vietnam War, and then joined the Cowboys by the time he was 24. I don't know who that is. So, so who, who gives a fuck? I think that maybe you're, you're ready and you just don't even know it. So you're kicking me out? No, no. I just want you to get your own apartment by summer. Right, so you're kicking me out of the house. It's nine months from now. I mean, you, you, you have a baby in nine months. It's a long time. Are you moving in? Are you trying to push me out? What, like, what did I do? I thought we were cool. Scott, Scott, let's all be adults here. Come on, your mother has worked very hard for a very long time. And I'm gonna retire in a couple years, so things are gonna change around here. But in a good way. I mean, we, we think you, that you can do great things. Yeah, I know I'm gonna do great things, but like, I don't need you to tell me that. Like. This is, what's going on? This is, I, I, I don't like this. So be that as it may, until you leave, which is gonna be good for you and it's gonna be motivating, you're gonna have to pull your weight a little more around here. And one thing that we thought would help you contribute, would be easy, wouldn't be hard to do, is to help Ray bring his kids back and forth to school when he can't do it because of work. Like now, like today. You're joking, right? You want me to take your kid to school? The kid that I tattooed? I got two kids. The other one's seven. You're gonna make me babysit your kids? Do I'm on, I do drugs. Well, looks like you're walking. And thank you. I'm not cool with any of this, okay? And, and where do you expect me to live? And with what money? You know I'm a fucking bum, right? Yo, this is fucked up. Seriously, especially after last night, all that bonding boy bullshit. You're full of shit, man. You're a fucking liar. I'm gonna go walk your kids.